What do you have for us today? Thank you so much, Cynthia. I for sure missed you so much. And it's always an honor being on you with this, on the same set. There's so much today lined up in the sports bulletin. And I'll take it right away. Thank you, Cynthia. I'll see you back shortly. Don't go too far. <laughs> Let's talk sports. My name is Karen Kibet. Now, Homer Bay combined are the champions of the inaugural edition of the Eliud Owalo Super Cup after they beat Kisumu combined 4-2 on post-match penalties. The two teams had battled to a goal-less stalemate in the regular time. Siaya combined peeped a 10-man Migori combined by two goals to one to emerge third in the inter-county tournament sponsored sponsored by Eliud Owalo Foundation. Our very own reporter Achola Simon with the details. After two days of high octane football that pitted the best soccer talent in the four Luonyanza counties, <laughs> it was time for the best of the best to be crowned in a tantalizing finals between Homa Bay combined and Kisumu combined. <laughs> And after 90 minutes of yet another entertaining and closely fought encounter, post-match penalties came in handy to separate the best two teams in the three-day inaugural edition of Elud Owalo Super Cup. <laughs> Outstanding Homer Bay short stopper Badan Odunga put Homer Bay in the driving seat after he saved the first penalty kick taken by Kisumu Denyaman, Christopher Raila. Kisumu would go on to lose one more penalty as uh, Homer Bay expertly dispatched their first two. <laughs> Homer Bay lost the third penalty kick, giving Kisumu combined a gleam of hope, but Kisumu failed to capitalize on the blip as Homer Bay marched on for a 4-2 victory and a 400,000 Kenya shillings winner's token. <laughs> Kisumu received 300,000 Kenya shillings token as the first runners up. In the earlier game, Siaya rallied from a goal down to Pip Migori combined by two goals to one and clinched the third spot. <laughs> George Odiambo had opened the scoring for Migori combined in the 8th minute, but Siaya equalized on the 43rd minute. They would go on to take control of the game, and it came as no surprise when they took the lead deep into the second half. Migori was reduced to 10 men after Geoffrey Oma was shown a straight red for dangerous play. Siaya walks away with 200,000 Kenya shillings for finishing third, while Migori receives 100,000 Kenya shillings. <laughs> Best players captured in the tournament will have an opportunity to showcase their talent against Gormaya in a friendly match that will be played at Nilima Grounds in the Reda Sub County, Siaya County, on Saturday. Achola Simon, Prime Edition, Kisumu County. Hey!